The advantage of coverage of sports events is they are ritualistic. The group gathered there is participating in a ritual. Now, the, the, the Olympics were even more a group ritual than the ordinary competitive uh, event in a ball game or a single ball game, a single event, because they had a, a corporate meaning. Uh, it was not just a, pro, uh, a local, it was a, a sort of a worldwide meaning. And this is itself a ritualistic participation in a large uh, process. Television in fosters and favors a world of corporate participation in ritualistic programming. I think that was the, the great secret of a thing like the Olympics. People had the feeling of participating as a group in a great, meaningful ritual. And it didn't much matter who won. That wasn't the point. But I think TV tends to foster uh, that type of fa uh, pattern in events. Well, you might say it tends to foster patterns rather than events.